Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Anna here. So in today's video, we're gonna do a another repeat of one of my older videos. It will be of my basement, my wheelchair accessible basement. And thank you to everybody who has newly subscribed, or if you're, or if you're a subscriber, thank you. Your support means the world to me. It really helps my channel. And yeah, so just know that I am working on the book as currently, and I hope to make videos about the book very soon. Okay, signing off now. Keep on rolling. Um, drawers or anything underneath it because that way my wheelchair can get up close and that way um if I jump I don't have cabinets to run in or for my knees to bump into. So we have so, um when we were occurring in the basement um we had to get we got a new microwave. And I told my parents that I liked the push button, or the pull, or the, um, don't do that. Okay, that's stupid. Um, or the, the fact that it's easier for me to pull it out than hit the button. We have a, um, one that is a button opener upstairs, and that's really difficult for me. Um. To open so we um, really we had a hard time finding one for the basement but we did and it's just easy the stuff I can still get to but I will still need help but can someone be in front of and this is a um, stove and an oven but I can still hit the buttons pretty easily so that's Where's the on button? There's a light button. There's a light button. Oh, the light bulb. See, the buttons are pretty easy for me to hit. Hey, it doesn't take much for me to do it. So, that's pretty much the stove or the stove slash oven. So, studies have shown that um, people in wheelchairs can eat a Get to um side by side refrigerators more easily because I can pull up without damaging it and still get to what I need. And also, mm -hmm. well, yeah. but both the microwave, I mean not the microwave, the fridge and the um. The fridge and the uh, dishwasher are on my left side because they are my looser side. So I have more control. Okay. So we have um, 
in the open and my other furniture is completely get in and not block anybody. Um, so I can check you really quick. And then, yeah, Basically. Cousin, okay, this is my cousin on the main island. And my parents did that um, so that I could fit underneath it comfortably. Like this. And oh yeah, oh, I just the oh okay. This is not as good as it already. Okay, okay. But um, if I, if I have a better driver that day, I can get it closer. But yeah, so my parents measured my wheelchair to um when they made this. So that I can fit underneath it. So, and I use it for, we use it for dinner, and then also if I need to work down here, this is where you go. Because also, so this is our um, bathroom, and we have, um, um, as you can see, it is clear. Every every sink down here is clear, so that I can get um to it with easy access. Also, um the um the faucet is on the side because I learned that because of my curvature, this having the faucet on the side is easier for me, so I can easily. Turn it off and on. Um, with nothing. Um, bathroom. Well, not my bathroom. Well, yeah, it is kind of my bathroom. My bathroom. And this is um. I got to design it. Um, tell my parents what I want. This is my shower. My new shower. The lip is a little bit on um, the Hold on, I can't see it. Oh, am I in the way? Yes. Hold on. The lip, the lip is a little bigger than we, what we initially thought. And the shower is, I mean, the shower chair is bigger than me. Okay. And also the, um, the, um, what is that called? The ring sh shower head? Yeah, the shower head is um, um, easily adjustable so that I it can be adjustable for my wheelchair and for a normal person that stands up. Um, uh, my heat, so we have a heating lamp um, upstairs in my bed. In my bedroom, in my bathroom, but we learned that a, a wall heater is more easy or easier, and that's because why we have this is because with my muscles, if I'm not warm or that, if I get cold, I when I'm cold, my muscles get really tight. So that is, you just hit, you just scroll. How many minutes you want the thing on and then, right, yeah. And then it turns off automatically. And then we have the toilet is 88 proof, or 88 height toilets. That's all throughout the basement. Um. Yeah, I need to get a bar. A bar would be really helpful Um, for me to be in the kind of in the bathroom so I don't have my parents holding me because I'm really sure they don't have anything to hold me on to. And then... Do you want to talk about the office? The office? I was going to do a light. Oh, okay, go ahead. So these lights are um, rocket lights and we have them all throughout the basement or whatever they're called. And they're very easy for me to turn on it and off. So we're going to go into the bedroom slash office. This is our guest bedroom. 
Hold on. Our um, bedroom slash my office today. Um, so I do have to share my bathroom with the guests, but that's okay. Um, I can do a separate tour of my office area once I get everything set up and stuff. Ready to go. Um. So that concludes our um, tour of the basement. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you're already not or if you haven't already. And if you guys have any other comments slash uh, video suggestions or have any questions, just leave them down below, and I will try to respond to them as fast as I can. Thanks for watching. Bye.